<laughs> test the black urban community through cartoons and comic books the way that Static Shock did. When did Marvel ever show us walking? Tell the truth! Tell the truth! Static, static, static Shock! And I apologize! And I apologize for that! I'm still a real nigga! Yeah! Fire juice! Blue that shit is. Greasy gang, or don't bang, you know who it is and what it is. We here with... Oi! <laughs> Yours truly. The kid! Y'all niggas broke in the bitch. $500,000 on my wrist. $500,000 off the white bitch. Pulled up, drop top, that's a new seat. V12 motor, fuck with no covers. Cut me a nose if you smell in the odor. I got on Louis V boots, I'm a soldier. My drip done got colder since I done got older. Ain't whipping no soda, selling no color, but my arms are filled with boulders. I even got weather to know you. Tell the hot... Hey, Yo! Fucking man, stormy almighty man. Let's talk calling these folks, it ain't nothing. Fuck fucking these hoes, it ain't nothing. I pulled his car, he was bluffing. Oh, I keep the heat like an oven. Damn. All right, all right, so let's get it, man. Like, you yeah. about to start the car. You about to start it? Yeah, you gotta go to the car. He might jump it. Uh oh. Uh oh. All right, all right what's dripping? All right, this is what's dripping, fam. Like, I've been seeing you, you know what I'm saying? I saw you buy all that DBZ. Look at his shirt. Look at his shirt. Anime, yeah. stop playing. What anime this is? You know That's Kilowa, fam. From X Hunter. Yes. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, when you mix the anime, this is when you know you're a real live anime geek nerd and the dripper. And you mix the anime with the designer. You know what I'm saying? Oh. Another nigga would have wore a lavish shirt with the lavish shoes. No, nigga, I'm wearing 100 times 100, uh, 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 the thousand five million <laughs> kilowatt kilo shirt yes, with sir. the motherfucking lavish on because I'm splatting it. I'm I might come through with a motherfucking uh, 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 pure uh, blue eyes white dragon shirt from motherfucking my uh, my nigga uh, Yu Gi Oh. Yu Gi Oh. Hey yo. Hey yo. But what's the nigga? What's the what, what's the nigga that own his Kudo Khan? What's his name? Uh, uh, the nigga that own the blue car, the own the blue eyes white dragon. Ooh. Kido Khan. Yeah, yeah, I believe so. I believe so. Yeah, nigga. T S F. Hey, so Pokemon or Digimon? Which one? That's a whole Be real, fam. Question. Be real, fam. Oh. Digimon. Yeah! Stop playing with us! Digital monsters, Digimon. Digimon battle champion. Digimon had better movies and better uh, evolutions, but of course, I mean, Pokemon is Pokemon, though. Exactly. So I love yeah, Pokemon, but I'm a, I, I, res I got more respect for Digimon. Hey, y'all. And, I, and I, I, well, no, I enjoyed the Pokemon's game more than I enjoyed the Digimon game, but I still enjoyed the Digimon game. Facts. Same, same. All right, so let's step into the comic world. If you had to choose between Marvel and DC, who you rocking with? You better say the right answer. You better say it. Ooh. I ain't gonna lie, I gotta keep it gangster. I'm gonna rock with DC. Oh no! Oh no! Oh, no. I know, listen, why? Listen, I'm going to be real. I know all the lore. I know all the lore from both sides. I don't give a fuck if you want to talk about the one above all, you want to talk about the watcher, yeah. or if you want to talk about motherfucking me, uh, 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 dark side. You know what I'm saying? And, 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 and Armageddon. What I will say is this. I, DC is what introduced me. Stop with a 50 G unit. What? Yeah. What? Add the home on what I trained. Hey, hey, hey. Loose me into the, into the common universe. I was a fan <laughs> of DC and Marvel before the MCU existed. Yo. So therefore, this is why I don't respect. This is why Thank I you. Appreciate your man, bro. Want to know why? Because Superman will whoop everybody's ass in motherfucking me Marvel Universe on accident. We got the whole it's, it's not my fault that they made Superman the oh, strongest baby. motherfucker in it. They have to go get Sodomite for Superman. You have to go get One Punch Man for Superman. One Punch Man cannot be Superman. <laughs> Tell him. We went to the other day. Tell him. We went to the other day. Sodomite will punch through Superman. Oh, my God. Oh, wait, 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 wait. This is what we got to tell him. Marvel gang or don't bang. Stop playing. Okay. It's a Marvel. Or don't bang. They got no, one above all. We didn't even get to the car. We got X-Men.
We got Thanos. What's in What's in Hulk and Juggernaut on the banger? Hey, first of all, hey, first of all, first of all, let's speak about this. Let's speak about this. Marvel wouldn't be shit if it wasn't for a black man named Wesley Snipes Blade. Marvel wouldn't be shit if it wasn't for a black man. Save it, motherfucking ass. DC, DC gonna be DC regardless. Nobody fuck with Superman returns. All the man to steal some shit. Batman, we can see he don't even kill people. Tell him. He got on all black for no reason. <laughs> Marvel. Iron Man makes more money than Batman. That's a fact. Iron Man makes more money than Batman. Does not make more money than Batman. I, maybe <laughs> in the movie, in the box office, in the box office, yeah. in the box office. Yeah. Nobody in the world has paid a million dollars for an uh, uh, Iron Man suit. Huh? Everybody pays millions of dollars for Batmobiles. Huh? You want to Google yeah. how many? You want to Google how many regular motherfuckers yeah. bought a Batmobile? Yeah. Where's the, how many people bought an Iron Man suit? An Iron Man suit? Huh? We just be real about this now. I understand what the MCU has done to the public because a lot of people would have never had any level of interest into superheroes if it wasn't out for the MCU. If the Marvel Cinematic Universe did not exist, a lot of black people wouldn't even fuck with superheroes. I was looking with superheroes and anime since 1995. Who got more money? Hold on, let's ask this question. Since we talk, who has been watching uh, uh, Marvel since? X-Men, the original motherfucking series in the 1990s on Fox Network. Who been watching motherfucking DC in them since Boomerang was showing the, the original Justice League okay. where they meet at the Justice, where they had to fight against the Legion of Doom. Okay. And they meet at the Hall of Justice. Okay. Where the first black superhero was Black Lightning. Okay. Can we understand that Blade was the black, the first black cinematic superhero to save the Marvel franchise, but who was the first black superhero, period? The first black... <laughs> Thank you, okay. but guess what? But guess what? DC cared about the black people before Marvel did because they had black lightning out. <laughs> but they didn't care about the black man until they needed him to survive. Marvel didn't care about the black superhero. They never gave Blade no airtime. Hey, let's talk about the real. Okay. Marvel never gave Blade no airtime on Spider-Man original TV series on Fox. <laughs> Can you ask that question? When did Marvel and Fox give Batman some airtime on Spider-Man. What he got? Two episodes, one episode. Guess what? They had Black Lightning in the entire mother, the entire series of the Justice League. He know his shit, man. He so he spent DC we K like get, that. We can when as soon as they gave us static. No matter of fact, matter of fact, excuse me. When did Marvel ever give us a motherfucking TV show that we could love like Static Shock? <laughs> a TV show. Hey. The Flash is not Static Shock. Blended <laughs> Marvel tests the black urban community through cartoons and comic books the way that Static Shock did. When did Marvel ever show the ghetto? Did Marvel, hey, hold on. Did Marvel ever show the ghetto? Did Marvel ever show the ghetto? 10 years later, 15 years later. You didn't grow up watching Luke Cage. You didn't want to be a bald head man growing up. You didn't want you wanted to be Static Shock. <laughs> Every black kid in America wanted to be static shock. You didn't want to be Luke Cage. You probably didn't even know about him. No. <laughs> Nobody wants to be a big, swole, bald head man in a yellow t shirt. Wait a minute. Oh, you talking about black? Niggas want to motherfucking yeah. get on that motherfucking dumpster Sorry, can lightning. and fly. Fly by. And he shot lightning. My name yeah, is and he play, and, 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 and they play rap oh, music. Oh, and they, and, they, and, they, play and, and guess what? Guess what? Guess what? When did Marvel ever put rap music in their cartoons? In their comic books? Never! <laughs> DC did! <laughs> is that a shock? You fucking crazy? No, Romeo made this song. DC, no, Romeo is the fucking song. Yo! Yeah, Yo! Yo. Static! Static! Static shock! Static! 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 He's black. Oh. Yo. Because yeah. he's black. DC been put on for the black community before Marvel Tide came three years later. That's you all talking I gotta about say. black community? He put who put on period? What black people? Yeah. So more black the people. Avengers or Justice League? Avengers. Tell me right what now. Avengers. Just, can I just say MCU. MCU. Who? That's that's fucking movies. This shit been around for eighty five years before movies fucking ever existed with superheroes. Who made the most money in comic comics. books? Who made the most DC. money in cartoons? DC. Okay, we are gonna talk about who, who animated movies do better. Who animated? I'll, I'll give DC that one. I'll give DC that one. I'll give DC that one. Where did it start at? 
This started in animation, correct or not? Yeah, yeah. It did not start in live action films. Just like anime. Nope. This starts with the artistic art form of cartoons. Yeah. Batman. Marvel did not win that. Marvel did not win. Yeah, Marvel did not win. All right, all right. We about to do one more question. Bruce Wayne and Tony Stark, who got more money? Bruce Wayne and Tony Stark. Tony Stark, man. Stop playing. Stop with sauce walking. Tell the truth. Tell the truth. You know Tony got more money. You know Tony got more money. And he got more degrees. I know. And he got more degrees. He's a billionaire philanthropist. You want? He's a billionaire philanthropist. Hey, somebody Google it. Somebody Google it, fam. Y'all got to understand. Y'all do, y'all, y'all do understand what Batman is rich for, then you understand what Tony Stark is rich for, right? Okay. All right. Tony, Tony, Stark, Tony Stark is only rich for selling weapons Bro, of mass destruction and electronics. Mm-hmm. Batman uh-huh. owns half of the world that he lives in. He's a real Y'all estate. Small as shit. That shit like the same thing. Thank you. It's, it's literally in New York. No, I'm, it's literally. I'm, I'm, I'm not talking about Gotham. First of all, New York is the biggest city in America, they, and, and they made they made Gotham off of New York the biggest city in America. Yes. Like Tony Stark. True. Twenty point three billion. Wayne Enterprises. Thirty one point. <laughs> He's a billionaire philanthropist. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, shit. You know how much motherfucking money you got to spend on the suit to be Superman? <laughs> yeah. the suit. Nigga, I got a suit that breeds kryptonite. Yo. This shit don't even exist. <laughs> That nigga made Say. it. Nigga, this man is his job to fight, uh, not even arguably, the most diabolical supervillain in the entire superhero spectrum. Yeah, it's no Joker. I don't give a fuck about it. He don't got no. Yeah, come yeah. on. Let's be real. He don't got no powers. Come on, let's no be real. Is the power, man. man, my nigga, my, my, man, my nigga Superman ain't never killed nobody, ain't never tripped and lost his fucking sanity over no being. This nigga has. <laughs> fought the damn universe. Yep. This nigga has punched black holes in the fucking uh, the fucking dimension of Earth time Bitch. spectrum. Yep. But guess what? Joker made him punch a hole through his heart. <laughs> yeah. That guy is too much for me. <laughs> this man it's made true. Batman lose his sanity <laughs> because yeah. you turned my best friend into a murderer. Yep. This man made Superman evil. This man's mind is so fucked up. You made the most honest, integrity-having, justifying, great, noble superhero to ever exist become a fucking evil menace. That's how fucking... Man, respect my nigga Batman. Yeah, respect my nigga Batman. Joker has never... I mean, Iron Man has never fought the likes. Of anyone that crazy. Of a fucking Joker, bro. I'm sorry. Hey, hey Tony Stark say the world, you feel me? I'll give him, you know, you gotta give him that. You say the world, the aliens coming through. MCU. I don't respect nothing about the MCU. I love the MCU. I'm a fan of the MCU. I do not respect it because it's not 100% canning. So therefore, by not being 100% canning, it's in its own universe, in its own spectrum with its own rule set. Right. Therefore, meaning that if they never was eligible to break way in the in a in a in a, in a cinematic platform. And universe, a large amount of America would not have the same respect for them. Like the Power Rangers. The Power Rangers has not had the extensive, has not had the extensive dent in identity and staple in animation and and, 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 and uh superhero lore. They have not had the same level in them in in a, in a box office in a movie theaters they have not had the same level of opportunities where you split up the power rangers and give the blue rangers his own movie and get a red ranger and a green ranger his own movie they never had this opportunity but still 40 years later they're in the in the comic book world in the co- a- animation in um a sitcom television tv show world they still reigning as the is the top most streaming super american superhero franchise ever yes sir without movies I don't believe that Marvel could have achieved that without movies. That's why when that's that's why Marvel started selling to Fox 
DC never sold shit to nobody because we never ran out of money because we have always been successful in selling merchandise and having a selling point. Marvel has not always been successful with having a selling point. It was a point where people didn't give a fuck about Wolverine. The world has never not gave a fuck about Batman and Superman. It's impossible. To say for the world to not give a fuck about Batman and Superman to say that the world would not give a fuck about Nike and Adidas. I'm sorry. <laughs> I am t- a nigga can't beat me. I am very intelligent, bro. So at the end of the day, you have I, to... I hope y'all are listening to this, man. This is facts, bro. We're going to get a sauce anime. This is, why, this is why we need this, man. Me and Sosa Man working on the anime right now. Me and Sosa Man working on the anime right now. The only thing, the only staple that Marvel has that's compatible and close to what DC has established with the Justice League and Batman and Superman is Spider-Man. That's it. That's the only thing that you can speak of in close and, and, and put in the same retrospective as what DC is now. In the movie world, Marvel has it, but that's one spectrum of what's being done. That's like being in the NBA and y'all got the best defense, y'all got the best offense, but you're not winning the most championships. Right, right. Because you got good of, stats, but not good as a team. Exactly. But what that means, because why? Marvel, I mean, DC is always ahead in, in animated film. They always ahead in comic book sales. They always ahead in merchandising sales. They always ahead in video gaming. DC is always ahead in all other spectrums of entertainment except for movies, bro. So it's just the fact that movies are so big and so catastrophic to the public opinion and, and, and the... the the, uh, the 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 scaling of the, the of how people call themselves critics cr- professional critics mm-hmm. people scale from the sales of box offices versus the scaling of the growth of a company and how much uh, finances they're a- able to generate yearly and annually whether it's residually or it's from direct sales of comic books and streams and book downloads right in those areas Marvel does not win Marvel wins in the area that everybody is most popular about the same way with Instagram and TikTok but that's not that does not mean that uh, just because TikTok is more popular, it's it's not generating more revenue for people and for itself than Instagram or even the Facebook. Mm-hmm. And that's just the facts. But I understand Marvel MCU Universe was the bridging gap to, to merge the urban community that looked down upon uh, superheroes and having understanding about superheroes and looking at yourself as a person with superpowers, our community looked at that as bullshit or that's some fake shit or that's uh, having fantasy or, or thinking thinking outside of the box is lame. That's not no street shit. That's not no masculine shit. That's not reality. So therefore, we have we as a as a as a community of people separated ourselves from that from thinking of ourselves as bigger than a normal human. To be a fan of superhero shit, you 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 leave open the room for the possibility of the fact that you could be something greater than a regular human. We was not, that was not a part of our daily bread to, to process that as food. So therefore, we was against that reading books. We don't read books. We don't read comics. We don't, that's not something that's coming around us. That's coming to them. Mm-hmm. That's why the fandom and, the, and, the, and the, the, the sales and the revenue that's being generated from DC for all of these years has always exceeded Marvel because Marvel had, did not have a leg in the real entertainment world until they got into movies. They were still something. They were still doing well, but they had to sell so many of their properties to Fox to survive. They sold uh, Fantastic Four to Fox. They sold Spider-Man to Fox. And they stole, I mean, they sold X-Men to Fox. Yep. That's three of their most biggest properties. X, uh, 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 fucking um, um, Fantastic Four is the first in the, in the original superhero group of Marvel. Fantastic Four was there before there was a fucking Avengers or there was an X-Men. Facts. And y'all sold it because they needed the equity to continue on. DC has never been through that problem. So who's really better? I fuck with DC. <laughs> he, he was preaching. Huh? He was preaching. It's a lot of it's a lot of knowledge right there, fam. It's a lot of knowledge. You got any questions for him? One more? Shit, we're going to switch it up. We're going to do something. Well, we got our anime coming. It's coming soon. Hey, y'all. Sauce Walker yeah. is Sauce Man, the Central Sauce and TSF Business. We got our own anime and video game coming. Just stay tuned. It's going to go up like a hot air balloon. Just be in the room. Yes, sir. All right, now we're going to go ahead and cut to the dripping part. What's up with the dripping? We're going to talk about these diamonds you got out here, man. Hey. See you splashing. You know what I'm saying? You know? Slide up, man. <laughs> what about them? They all beautiful. They all spill. They all the deal. You know what I'm saying? How you feel? Yeah. Uh, talk about it. Talk about your favorite piece. I mean, your this, least a, favorite this piece. a two. This a two carat pink diamond, natural pink stone right here. You know what I'm saying? That's about eighty-eight thousand dollars. This a five carat uh, heart shade, VVS quality, 
see through like two two grades up on the flawless. I pay like one ten for that. I mean, you know, we got the, all of these braces. One ten. Yeah, one ten for one diamond. Yes, sir. Damn. You know what I'm saying? One ten for one diamond. My earrings is one hundred thousand each ear. One hundred thousand for this ear. One hundred thousand for this. Two hundred thousand. Five kids. BBS flawless see through. You know what I'm saying? With the paperwork, GIA certification. You know, my diamonds got birth certificates. A lot of a lot of people <laughs> diamonds don't got paperwork with it. They don't got okay. birth certificates. You know what I'm saying? Say my, my, my diamonds got a birth date a in birth the hospital. Day. My diamonds come from a hospital and a birthday. Yeah. My, my diamonds come from a what? Hospital. Come hospital. from the hospital? Yeah, you still oh, yeah. You hospital. 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 They come okay. from the hospital. <laughs> so, you know, we, we, we all independent, you know what I'm saying? You know, no record deals, you know what I'm saying? We, we started from the ground, you know what I'm saying? We, we don't wear little boy diamonds. If it's, if any rings of any sort is going to be pointers, more pointers than Tom Warner's, you know what I'm saying? We rock 50s, pointers, 60 pointers. What? What you want to ask about my neck? Yeah, let's go to the 80, neck. Let's I go got, to the neck. What about it? It's 80 pointers on my neck. What's them tennis is here for, man? All together, this is about six hundred thousand dollars. Easy, man. About, about, probably about six fifty. You know what I'm saying? Because the the sixty point the sixty point chain I got by itself is one eighty five thousand, one hundred eighty five thousand for the sixty pointer. That's the big boy right there. You know what I'm saying? You can add it up yourself. You know what I'm saying? Out East Diamond. East Diamond. East Diamond. East Not Diamond on that hoe, fifteen hundred. East okay. Diamond. Okay. Put pure. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, so I want to know. Wait, 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 wait. So look, if we looking at this one right here, the that biggest 15, one, the then biggest then one, then this diamond, one, fifteen hundred. Then that one, fifteen. Then this one, fifteen. Each sixty point is fifteen hundred. Oh, okay. Each sixty point is fifteen hundred. So all the way around, just added up fifteen hundred <laughs> all the way around. All the way around. There's like forty diamonds on there. You know what I'm saying? I got a, a sixty pointer, a fifty pointer on, two thirty pointers, and a and a and a, and a, and a uh. And I think it was like a like a twenty. But you keep it clean though. Yeah. Yeah. Six. I got six yeah. diamond chains. Got so many pointers. He pointing in all directions. For real. Same I got more. This this <laughs> this Maybach truck. This Maybach truck right here. I got the title in the back. Right. I got the title in the back. Check that. You want to see the title? This nigga want to yeah, see this the title. Yeah. This is it. It's all right here. Four hundred thousand dollars. I paid two hundred thousand dollars over t over sticker for it. TSL business. We got we independent. Independent, man. Yes, sir. All That's the best way Let's talk about these lemons right here, gotta man. Gotta stay independent. A lot of people don't man, know what been, them is, man. You know what? I knew about these shoes two years ago, but I ain't want to buy none because I, I I stopped wearing designer for like two years because I feel like that's like some follower shit. I don't, I, I'm sauce. I drip. I got my own ingredients, my own flavor. I, I, don't, yes, sir. I don't do what other people do. I don't follow trends. I make trends. I set trends. Ain't nobody else putting up $300,000 diamonds surgically in their face before I did it. I, I do shit that never been done before. Ain't nobody had no, diamond, no diamond lighter leash before. I made up a diamond lighter leash. Now you see Eliante and everybody when they had diamond lighter leashes. I made up all that shit. Diamond water chains, I came with all of that shit first. I don't <laughs> yeah. do nothing that nobody else do. Everything I do, I try to be the first to do it or at least do it in a way that it's not uh, replicated. That's right. You know what I'm saying? So at the end of the day, True to that's how I drip. I don't follow change. So when everybody was wearing the I didn't want to wear them because I didn't want to wear a shoe that everybody else was wearing, making it popular. I went and created my own shoe brand and then did a partnership with Cool Kai and start wearing his shoes. I know who Cool Kai is. I fuck with him. I fuck with him. I'm on my feet. You know what I'm saying? I'm about entrepreneurship more than me. Black giving, business. I'm about business, period. I don't care if it's black, white, green, or purple. Okay. I support everybody business, not just black business. But I understand re the recycle of the dollar. I'm not going to invest all of my money into things that don't any way, shape, or form, re resurface their money back into the same community or the same uh, aspects of my hustle that I do. If I'm gonna spend some money with you, I need to know there's a possibility that the child will spend money with me or my company in the future. Okay. Oh, maybe y'all do a photo shoot with us. Maybe y'all book us to to represent y'all to do uh, to do a uh, walk on a uh, red carpet, a, a sponsorship, ambassador, brand ambassador, whatever. It's so heavy. No, I've had real deals with um, fashion companies, Bushimi. Uh, Bathe and Ape, Supreme, um, who else I had to deal with? Somebody else too. But you know what I'm saying? I just try to support the people that support us. Yeah. yeah. Hell yeah. Shit, we gonna get up out of here, man. Appreciate the interview, dog. Shit, y'all. You know what I'm saying? Y'all boys keep continuing to reach crazy. And like always, Greasy Gang greasy. or Don't Bang. Uh. Mm. It's your boy Tony it, checking out, man. <laughs> yeah, Got this good old interview. You know what I'm saying? A long time coming. <laughs> when it came. <laughs> yeah! Fire juice! Yeah. <laughs>